This video is about topic 4-1, dividing by multiples of 10 and 100. We learned how to multiply digits that ended in zeros um, by multiplying the non-zero digits and then adding on the zeros. This lesson is pretty similar, except it's the opposite and is with um, division. So if we had something, whoops, like 540 divided by 9, I can divide just the non-zero digits. So 54 divided by 9 is 6, and then add on any zeros that I was missing. So my answer would be 60. And the reason this works is because we can think about this zero as like a label. One zero is 10, um, because one zero, or 10 has just one zero. So we could think about this like 54 tens, or 54 of our skinnies, divided into nine groups would be six skinnies in each group, or six tens, which is 60. We can even use this to work with even bigger numbers, such as 48,000 divided by six. Again, first look at any digits that are not zero, so 48 and six. 48 divided by six is eight, and then I'm gonna add on my one, two, three zeros to get my final answer of 8,000. Again, you can also think about those zeros as a label. 48,000 divided by six, think about thousand as my label, would be 8,000. Here's one last example. Let's say I had something like 15,000 divided by five. I'm gonna underline my non-zero digits and 15 divided by five is three, and then I'm gonna add on my three zeros for my final answer of 3,000. So sometimes you can do division without even using long division. This would be considered mental math. I want you to go ahead and try this problem for me. 3,200 divided by eight, good luck.